Hello, my name is Eric Shriver. I'm the Sales and Marketing Director for Falling Water Construction. And if you're interested in a career in construction sales, you will need a few basic um, abilities, and that is to make, be able to make a good first impression, to be able to communicate features and benefits to a client, to be able to climb a ladder and inspect a roof, to be able to draw a diagram and run a tape measure. And if you've got those basic, basic skills, then construction sales could be something you really want to look at. There's a lot of money in construction sales. Construction sales is um, it is a door-to-door -door business. So you've got these storms that come through these neighborhoods, and the neighborhoods get inundated with salespeople. Falling water is no different. We come in there, we knock the doors, we, we make the um, contact. We're all, we also have another a lot of other marketing programs that we use to make contact with the customer, but one of them is going to be the project manager and making the initial contact. When you do that, you've got about four seconds to make a good first impression. And a good first impression is appearing sharp as a tack, enthusiastic, and an authority figure on, on the subject. To become an authority figure on the subject, you've got to have the basic knowledge of construction, residential restoration construction. It's not brain surgery. We're using immigrants a lot of times to do this work. And it doesn't take a couple of years to, to, to master to being able to communicate about it. What you've got is a, a scale that you need to become unconsciously confident to really have a big success at doing this. You can make money being consciously confident. For sure, you're going to get 20%, 30% of your sales, which is a numbers game. And a lot of guys make a good living being consciously confident. But once you reach the unconscious confident level with construction sales, your numbers are going to just take off. And to, to achieve that, a lot of people, one of the things in, in all knowledge is knowledge is a path. And the path starts out as being unconsciously incompetent with anything you know. So your unconsciously incompetent is like comparing a child that's just out of a car seat being knowledgeable on driving. He doesn't even know that he can't drive. The child gets in the car and his parents take him wherever he needs to go and that's it. He doesn't even think about it. Once a child gets to the age of around nine or 10, he starts understanding that he can't drive a car, that he needs someone to take him, that he can't turn the key, he doesn't know how to do it. Once a child or a person gets to the age of 16, 17 years old, he's taking driver's ed, he's able to drive with an adult in the car with him, he can focus on driving, he can't be distracted, but he can drive, and he's consciously confident in it, he can, he can get the job done. Now, once a person gets in his 20s and 30s, he's been driving for a few years, they have, and they become unconsciously competent. They're able to, to drive and, and be distracted, which isn't a good thing, but they can do that. And that's just like any knowledge, they become unconsciously competent. They don't have to think about a stop sign. A light turns red, they stop automatically. The same thing with construction sales. To really become successful, you're gonna to have to become unconsciously competent. And that's something that falling water, if you show some basic um, skill sets, we're gonna take the time to get you there. And it's not something that will take more than a month or two to do as well as becoming unconsciously competent at, at being able to sell someone and keep them on the path of closing them and getting them to the point of decision making. A lot of times all you're doing, especially in construction sales, because the decision has to be made, is getting them to that point. You're taking them on a path from knowing that they need to get a contractor to fix all these repairs for their home to going with you and falling water because falling water has the features and benefits they need that gives them back control of, of their home, which is our A plus business rating, it, our license and insurance, our warranty, our website that shows all of this. It's very comprehensive, it has references. So we're gonna have we're, we're gonna give you those tools. We have those tools in place. Another tool we have is that we have a territory management program that's an app that for your phone that we put together that is going to allow you to when you're knocking doors to within three clicks record the information of what you've got when you go there you're going to have a map on there you're going to click on the home it's going to bring their address up the next click that you're going to be able to decide if they were home or not if they were responsive if they've already gone with someone else and then there's a place of course for notes and anything like that if you need to come back again if you need to send them some information in the mail whatever we're going to need to do to close that sale 
and it's going to track all of this for us. It's something the competition really doesn't have, and it allows us to penetrate a neighborhood really deep because we're tracking every house and what's happened there. So it's just it's a great tool. All of our features and benefits that we have separates us from everyone else, and our subs are second to none. There's a reason why we have an A plus rating. It's because we've never had a complaint. So. That, that speaks volumes for us. You know, only a small percent of the construction companies have an A plus rating. Only a smaller percent have a 10 year warranty. Even again, even a smaller percent has a comprehensive website with references and, and tools to show the client the work we already have. And an even smaller percent is gonna have the, the app and the tools, the selling tools to make sure that you close those sales, you go back, you follow up, and you have success in the sales game. All righty, well, give us a call. We would love to hear from you. You know, if you've got a situation in your life to where you know, you're determined this year to take that luxury vacation, great. Pick up the phone and call me. If your wife feels that you're incompetent and you're not a good provider, great. Pick up the phone and call me. If the neighbors are making you feel like you're lesser in the neighborhood because the car you drive in is as nice as theirs. That's great. Pick up the phone and call me and we can address these issues and get you on a path to success. Alrighty, thank you.